Okay. The device is off. So we're set at volts right now. And it says 0, 0.0. Now watch. I'm going to turn it on. It says 0, 0.0. Let's add a little voltage from the Variac. Still 0, 0.0. Oh, now she's starting to move. So 0 0.01. All right, so now here are my volt probes. I'm just going to put that one right there, all right? You're going to touch this one. It says 62. Oh, I got it. There it goes. 62. Touch this one. One sixty. One seventeen. Two eighty two. All right. So, a buddy of mine, and we have the load on. I mean, it's not a whole lot. It's about thirty, thirty watts or so at ten hertz. So, check this out. Here's our plant. Let's stick this guy in the plant. Alright, so it's grounded. So it's definitely in the plant. Put this guy right here so we can see what we're doing. Hundred and thirty two. Basically out of nowhere. 132 again. Now let's switch the leads, switch the probes. So we're going to stick that one in the plant. Get this one. Weird, huh? All right. So that's one of the anomalies. The other anomaly, check this out. Coming off of the ballast amp reads 0.54, but we follow this around and we have that hooked up to here. All right, so we'll just do that again. Point oh six amps here. Point two seven. Nothing really changed. I went from one wire to the other wire. Point oh five. Point two seven. Weird, right? Okay. On the return on the ballast. Point almost one amp, but where it's connected, point oh two. It's a hundred and ten watt ballast, so there's not one amp coming off of it, or point two five for that matter. It's a because the voltage is being changed. So this is most likely right here the true measurement at point oh one. See here, coming off. That's the hot, so it's 0.04 amps. At, let's see here. It's hard to do this with one hand. So let's see if I can. Oh, just gets a little wild sometimes. Kind of scary. Hmm. How can we do this? Well, anyway, 
I'll just put that up there and then we'll show you because this is um, this is outputting like 300 volts at point oh what was it four amps and then this is outputting 40 or 50 volts at almost two amps but it's all at 10 Hertz so definitely free juice as long as you input just 10 amps pretty easy but I just wanted to show you the anomalies sorry about the shakiness I'm doing this off my phone and I got one hand so have a nice one